Welcome. All right. So in this case, what we have is ln of e, and you know, looking at any of the our, you know kind of properties of our sorry ball going off, um, any of our properties of logarithms, um, you'll usually see this as you know kind of like an identity that we have. And just to kind of go back through, you know, what this really again means, let's go back with a common logarithm. If I had log base 5 of 5, and I say, you know, what does that want to equal? Well, I could say 5 raised to the x equals 5 raised to what power? Well, obviously, we know that that x also has to be x as well. Um, five, I'm sorry, let's think about this. 5 raised to what power is going to equal 5? Well, we know that x has to equal 1. So in this case, if I was going to do the exact same thing, the couple things with the ln that we need to make sure we understand is that ln has a base of e. So therefore, if I wanted to rewrite this, I'd say e raised to what power is e going to equal e? Well, therefore, we can understand that the ln of e is always going to equal 1, which is a very common identity, but something that we just need to keep on remembering when we're evaluating logarithms. And of course, we can do it without a calculator. Thanks.